We're checking out the 2K Quad HD dash cam diamond lock dash camera for cars vehicles. 2K plus HD 1080p Wi-Fi dual dash cam. Front and rear with a 64 SD gig card. 170 degrees wide angle. Super night vision. G sensor. WDR. Loop recording. Parking monitor. And events. The LF-D518 dash cam, user manual, the dash cam, suction cups, permanent suction cup, the hard wire for your rear view camera, a USB micro SDXC card slot, and the 12 volt USB cable that powers up along with some set screws and self adhesive stickers. The dash cam comes in a nice box that has a magnetic opening and there is your dash cam and it is a very easy install simple as one two three going over the main unit you have here is the tripod socket is a micro one it screws in and the thumb bolt wheel will tighten down the 2.5 millimeter port the USB-C port on the front of the unit you have here looks like a camera a TF, an up, an M, a down, an OK, picture of a camera, the menu, and the on and off. This has a built-in battery. It also has a speaker, a reset button, and a mic button. You have an included 64 gig card that you're going to take to the side of the camera and install. When you first plug this in, it may ask you to completely format the card. And all you do is turn on the unit like so. It greets you. You can hit the menu button on the side. It automatically records when it starts up. You can see the time, the resolution, the file, the date, the time, the G-force and so forth. If we want to stop recording you can hit the OK button and the record stops. If you hit the menu, it gets you into the resolutions and you hit the OK for resolution to set up for 1080p or 2K resolution. You hit the opposite side to scroll down for loop recording, three minutes, one minute, five minutes, and back to off. Hit OK. And then you have your Wi-Fi connection, your screensaver, your frequency, your language, your audio, your rear mirror, preview mode, your sensor, your date and time, your volume, your format. You click OK on the format. You click OK again to fully format the card. Continue down, you have the video CSD and restore factory settings. About and back to resolution. If you hit the M, it backs out and you're on the main screen. You hit M again, you have your backup camera if hooked up. You could change it to the front view and rear view, front view and all rear view. Those are the options you have. This is a three inch screen with the front camera 2.K and the rear camera at 1080p with night vision. With a 24 hour monitoring parking system, a 120 gig capacity on the card, and we're gonna show you the install and some driving of what this unit can do. Steps are very simple. Find a place you wanna mount, stick up, Run your 12 volt USB A to USB C charger cable to your dash cam with the tool they give you to separate your paneling. We're going to do our best to trace our wires from the camera to the cigarette lighter. Very simple step. You just basically plug in, run your cable up like so and you could be done like that if you want the easy way out we are going to simply just trace it along the best we can 
above our sun visor and into the dash cam and then bring this down along the airbag to the outlet. I put my leads in like so. I take the little spacer so I can grab my weather stripping, pull it around and tuck it in. My cigarette lighter could be here, anywhere else. And I just basically tuck the rest in. And we have the backup camera with a 12 volt lead that's going to go to your rear light. Meaning when you put your car in reverse, this will turn on the camera in reverse in full. And that's what that lead is for. So we're gonna mount this anywhere we want on our license plate in the back window, as long as you can get this power and it has a disconnect cable over here in case you need to disconnect. Pull it out and then slip it back in like so. As you dress your cable, you have all this slack that you're gonna bring up and bring it to the camera on the top. When all done, that's what you have all hooked up. The Diamond Park LD518, your dash cam camera, it can record front and rear files, event files, parking files, very easy to operate. Download the app, use the Wi-Fi, and I hope you enjoy your product if this is right for you.